Let me show you how to download and install the Silders Vibrant shaders in Minecraft 1.21. If you're looking for this shader and how to do this, this is the best video that you can find on the internet. So let me show you how to do it right now. So the first step for you is to go to the video description. There's the download link for the Silders Vibrant shaders. And there actually are two different links. So please click on the first one. This is for the Silders Vibrant shaders. In here, scroll down until you get to the, to the download section, as you can see in here. And let's click on the Silders Vibrant shaders. It will take us to the main website of the Silders Vibrant. And uh, you need to check uh, or to choose the one uh, version you want. So then once you want it, for me, I like to use the extreme version, I hit download. Then wait five seconds and uh, it will take us to another website crossforge and in, in here you can just hit download again five seconds that's nice and uh, the silver's vibrant will be downloaded now click on the second link in the descri video description that's for the iris shaders and scroll down to the download links again and click on the iris shaders hit the download now download the universe jar and it's instantly instantly downloaded which is fine so now we just take the iris installer and silver's vibrant uh, shaders and let's drop it on the desktop what we need to do now is to go to the windows search bar type in percent app data percent hit enter this will open up the roaming folder for us and in here go to the dot minecraft scroll down to the shader packs and take the Silders Vibrant shaders and drop it in the shader packs folder. Now go back, uh, find the versions folder, which is in here, just uh, two folders down uh, under the, the shader packs folder. And let's double click on the iris installer, choose the correct version for us, it would be the Minecraft 1.21. And if you want to play with the shaders only, use iris only, but if you want to play shaders and mods, for example, use iris plus fabric and hit install. As you can see, it's completed. So we can close this one and let's make sure that uh, you have the iris fabric loader 1.21 installed in the version folder. If you don't see it in here, you need to reinstall uh, the iris shaders because you've made a mistake somewhere. We can uh, we can put this uh, file in the bin and let's open up Minecraft launcher. And let's let's wait uh, until we get uh, to the Minecraft launcher uh, where we can select the versions because we need to make sure that we are launching the correct version. Uh, for us, it would be the Faber, uh, Iris and Sodium for 1.21. Uh, once you select the version, you can hit play but let me sh let me just do one more quick thing i need to adjust more ram to have better um, performance nice so hit play as i've already done that now let's wait until we get to the Minecraft menu once we get in there we also need to activate the shader it's not just like that so let's extend the window uh, go to the single player choose your word mine word is share uh, not sherlock but uh, lashcraft and hit escape uh, go to options video settings shader packs enable the shader packs then double click on the Silos vibrant shaders and uh, hit apply um, after like one to two seconds uh, as you can see it's uh, already activated it's it does look phenomenal i absolutely love this shader it's it's extremely good shader and as you can see the water is super realistic uh, I've all, I also have a great performance and uh, yeah, you can just do so many stuff with this shader because uh, I like I like to take Minecraft pictures, for example, because it's it looks phenomenal. Just take a look on this. It's it's just good. And if you also do install the Distance Horizons mod, it's it's great. OK, so thank you so much, guys, for watching this video. I hope I have helped you to install this and see you soon.